Hey, what's up everybody? It's Jack. Welcome back. And um in uh in this video I basically wanted to discuss uh basically uh, Nintendo because as you may or may not know if you've been watching my my videos for long enough, I I'm 31 years old and I basically grew up playing Nintendo. Um a lot of Mario, a lot of Donkey Kong, a lot of all sorts of Mario Kart, all sorts of different games that came out. Uh, during that generation, Turtles in Time, one of my favorite games of all time, Alien vs. Predator, I mean, the list goes on and on and on, and, you know, today, like the geek that I am, I am going through, uh, I'm looking at IGN, and uh, there's all sorts of rumors about the new Nintendo console that's supposedly coming out, uh, the Nintendo NX, I think it's called, um, and, uh, you know, it's just it's just a bunch of rumors as of right now, but um, for me, there, even though I've pretty, I pretty much just play Call of Duty as of right now, you know, multiplayer first-person shooter is pretty much all I've been playing for the most part, unless like a really good, solid single-player game comes out that I'm interested in personally that kind of strays away from that, kind of like Batman, Arkham, or uh, God of War, for instance. God of War, to this day, is... Still the only reason for me that I want to buy a PlayStation above all else as of right now. But there's still a part of me. There's that little part of me that just aches to have like a really solid, relaxing, enjoyable Mario, Donkey Kong, all sorts of different Nintendo games experience um, that I haven't had in a while. And there's there's a part of me that just wants that and, 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 and enjoys it. You know, because when you get on and play Call of Duty, it's not always... It's not always entirely relaxing, simply because of the fact that you know you're you're focusing, you're you know you're trying to win, you're being competitive, and all that kind of stuff. And you know, I mean, for some people, it's more relaxing than others. But for the most part, there is a a certain number of uh, focus and and all these other things that come into play, especially when playing Call of Duty. So to kind of stray away from that and kind of do something completely different, that kind of exercises different muscles, so to speak, is something that appeals to me. And um, it's just exciting that, you know, we're getting another Nintendo console and um, all sorts of rumors are basically said about it, like as far as like streaming and um, uh, as far as everything that I've read, nothing is too revolutionary. It's pretty much going to it's pretty much going to be this standard up to to, you know, the Xbox and the PlayStation. It's not going to be anything too like far ahead or anything like that. It's just going to be up to par with everything else. But the the one thing that really really caught my attention also is the Nintendo Store whatever they call it I, I forgot the specifics but um, I would I would gladly dish out I don't know five to ten dollars you know for like some of the old Nintendo games that I grew up playing I don't I think ten dollars would be a little ridiculous unless it's like maybe the N64 games which I missed out on by the way simply because of the fact that um, under peer pressure I basically bought a PlayStation back when I was in eighth grade instead of an N64. I actually wanted an N64 and everybody was like, PlayStation, 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 but hey, at the same time, I did I did get introduced to Duke Nukem because uh, that was the first game that I bought uh, when I got the PlayStation, but um, the N64 days are really something that I wish that I had partaken in. Um, friends had it and I always enjoyed playing the console when uh, on uh, whenever I went to their houses back in the day. So, yeah, it's just... Um, it's just it's just really good that a new console is coming out and, and hopefully it'll kind of go back to the roots of what Nintendo was in the first place and uh, I'm excited for it uh, as of right now I don't think too many things are set in stone in terms of what we're gonna get but um, we definitely know for sure because you know Mario and Donkey Kong and Zelda and those franchises pretty much run Nintendo they pretty much keep the heartbeat of Nintendo going so um, I personally am excited for a new Mario. Uh, I love Mario. Um, Donkey Kong, I absolutely love. The original on the on the Super Nintendo is one of my favorite games of all time. And uh, whatever else they can muster. Uh, Metroid, I've always liked Metroid, so God knows what they'll come up with that. But um, but yeah, I just wanted to discuss my my kind of excitement because you know it it really there is a part of me, a small part of me that's that wants to just play and relax. And just kind of relive the nostalgia of what I was when I was a kid. So, if any, I don't know how old you guys are that are watching this, um, but if you're around my age, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about from firsthand experience. And for those of you, the, the guys that are a little bit uh, younger, you know, you'll, uh, you know, you're gonna be thinking about the games that you're playing now, um, like let's say 10, 15 years from now, and you're gonna be like, you know what, those were the days, you know. But um, 
every generation is unique, I guess, in that aspect. But uh, yeah. Uh, one other thing I wanted to say is uh, I know that this gameplay here is uh, is old. I uh, yesterday I literally just uh, reached Prestige Master. Um, I don't know. I was thinking about doing like a stats and combat record kind of a video, but I don't know if you guys want to see that or I don't know if it's just too much of a bland kind of video because a lot of people out there do it. Um, and stats don't always mean a lot, but if you guys want it, let me know in the comment section and I will do it. But um, and uh, I gotta start recording again because I'm getting monster gameplays, especially with this new uh, TDM 100. I'm getting monster gameplays, and I've upped my sensitivity uh, thanks to uh, thanks to part a partial inspiration by Ronaldinho, because I've been watching his streams because he's been streaming again. So I upped my sensitivity, and uh, I also seem to aim better with a with a higher sensitivity. And uh, now that I've gotten more used to the game, I am uh, I'm able to do the things that I'm able to do. Um, or of what I'm capable of doing, so so it's becoming fun. It's uh, it's pretty interesting. So, but anyway, with that being said, guys, uh, I just wanted to talk about my excitement for Nintendo in this commentary. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. I apologize for the old gameplay, but uh, I will start recording again because uh, I just got to get back on the ball again. So, uh, if you like the video, let me know, and if you don't, let me know what I can do to make my videos better. I'll catch you guys later.